Hey guys, I'm Rose and welcome back to another Wolfenstein, The Old Blood. Last episode, last episode we finished out Chapter 4, uh, closing that out and moving into Part 2, which is the second half of the game. Uh, and we started Chapter 5, te technically, because that's pretty much the one after 4. Uh, it's, not like, it's not like Part 1, Chapter 4, and then Part 2, Chapter 1 kind of thing. It's like it's a continuation of a string of uh, chapters, but pretty much... So yeah, we got like 4 more chapters, including this one left. Uh, we just made ourselves known to Wolfberg, so we're we're in this t little town called Wolf Wolfberg. We're killing some Nazis as usual, and we're trying to get to this agent guy who who's in this town. Uh, and this agent will fill us in with things. But oh god, more commanders! Ugh. Uh, we got fifty and seventy meters away from both commanders. Well, not the same numbers of distance, but similar ish as usual and there's a robot turn guy again yippee ki -yay, eh okay ammunition i'm guessing they're giving us ammunition just in case we wanna we, we were fighting too hard in the other ever area but again stealth is great when you can do it right two machine is there two machinery Two machinery gun guys? I'm so confused why there's two of them. But they look like they're portable because they don't they're not attached to the to the sort of electric line that the other uh the other guys have been having back at Castle Wolfenstein, so it is intriguing to see that their machinery is a little different. So we're about fifty meters. One is kinda on the right side i'm i'm, I'm kind of relaying the information of what i'm seeing my face cam is blocking it i could easily solve this if i just move the face cam downwards a little bit more but i'm like part of me is lazy and part of me doesn't want to cut out of the the game just to okay i can probably move forward now it's hard because it's like or it's difficult to like not try to jump off this platform here Yeah, one is in this direction. Oh, there's a guard here. I didn't even see that. Is this guard gonna just stop there in the middle of nowhere? Yeah, indeed. Okay, I mean... <laughs> If it sees me, then I kind of feel like it could see me. If, like, if I can see him, he can see me probably. <laughs> but if you can't see, if I can't see him, then he can't see me. That's that's the kind of rule that I kind of keep in my head a little bit for safe for safety measures. Oh, sheesh! I better get moving a little bit. Ugh. I'm not a big fan of where I'm at here. It looks like it's a bad idea to jump down. That was a bad idea to jump down, but it's getting me closer to wherever this this other dude was at, I guess. It sucks that we can't prone. Like, we can't, like, go into prone position. I'm waiting till this guy moves away. Or at least sounds like he's moving away. Yeah, he's moving away. Oh god. I think one of them's up here, isn't it? it? Feels like one of them would be up here. One of the commanders. Or maybe one guard is up here. No way, there's no guard up here. Really? There is no guard up here. What in... Tarnation, really? Whoever decidedly not wanted to guard up here did a bad choice. <laughs> and I didn't know there was a gold up here. Oh god, we lost two golds! Why? <laughs> in the last two freaking spots, that, or the last few spots we went through. There's a door over here. Oh, there's a zipline we need to get to. Okay. All 
Alright, so the commander's over here, almost. I see him right there. But I need the silent takedown, though, or silent kills, at least, for this commander. And he's moving too far off. Dude. Okay, he's moving way too far away. I can't, I can't do that guy. The other one is over here, it seems like. Yeah, he's over there. He's walking away, too. Damn it. These two are, like, walking away. I wonder how long it takes for both of them to come back. I want to just destroy those two guys and then move on when I, when I can get both of them down, at least. I think that's the guy we were looking for. He's almost... Oh, he's stopped in the, behind the column. Really? That's so convenient of you to just stop behind the column. I can't... I don't want to risk it because he's moving a lot. And he's moving a lot. This guy is moving too much. No, not this window. This window. Oh, jeez. Okay, that's one guy down. At least that one's easier because he's, like, actually not, like, being, like, serious about where he's standing. This guy, however, is a little difficult because he just stops in the middle of the column. Maybe randomly. No, he's not stopping the column this time. No, he is. Never mind. It was stupid of me to believe that he would not stop behind that column. Okay, let me... Let me get this guy. Got him. Oh, at least it stops him. Like, shooting wrongfully just to get him to stop moving. That works the best. Oh, there's another guard over there. Sniper rifle dude, it looks like. I love how he just, like... <laughs> he just stands right... Conveniently right at the col- Everyone keeps standing behind the column just at a convenient time. I'll take that. Is there more guards, I wonder? Um... Got a little bit of something. Oh jeez, the other guy can get me already? Oh jeez, okay, I'm up, 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 up. Oh god. It's interesting to, like... Oh god, that was bad. Oh wait, no, why did I throw a knife? Okay, well I got health back anyways. I don't think they they got sight of me after that. Oh god, I, did I hit a street lamp? Oh, did I get him with the electricity thing? Okay, well that guy is gonna keep shooting at me, I guess. Okay, well I'm gonna have to do this, actually. <laughs> Gotta get two shotguns in one, I guess. Might as well. Oh, I'm dead. Wow, okay, well I screwed myself up. <laughs> Oh, no, I'm doing it all over again. Jesus Christ, no. Well, the only way there is to just go into the center place, I guess, it seems. 
The best place to it is just literally the center part of it, but even then I'd rather just take down the enemies with a turn or something. Climb, 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 climb. Okay. At least the climbing needs to happen, like, immediately. This is the only way to literally get rid of these guys anyways. But I need to be very careful with how I work this out. Where is the... The commander's walking away, so that means he's, he's still on the other side, though, the commander. Yeah, I'm thinking about just silent takedown on this commander guy and then, like, moving forward, moving on without having to destroy the other guys, the big army dudes, because I feel like it's much more needed to just get rid of them, like, quickly. I don't think I'm gonna get this one down easily, though. Uh, this is very, like, not frustrating, but very difficult because this guy can move. Oh jeez. Okay, screw it. I'm taking the other guy out first. Because if the other guy notices first or notices near him, then I'm screwed. There we go. I'll take it. Eagle Eye. Really? Okay, so I did take him down silently. Yeah, because it seems like I took down the other guy silently and that count it. I guess it just accumulates the count up. Yeah, silent takedown on the commander. As long as I do the action, I think it just saves it or increments it anyways. So, Eagle Eye Achievement Unlock is what I got, though, at the same time. So, at least that's good. Um, there we go. I'll take that. Let's take out the sniper rifle guy, and then we should... Why did he fall over like that? That was like exaggerated so hell. Uh, <laughs> exaggerate, exaggerated to hell with that. Right. I think the goal was right here, yeah. Or that was not the goal, who knows. If it is the goal, I'd be surprised. Oh, maybe I could just take them out silently too. You know what? That might be true, like... No, I just need... I think I need just the pistol? I might need to try it out to see if it works. I'm not... I'm not really <laughs> too confident here. Ah, jeez. Oh, god. Oh, F. Go! There we go. Oh, jeez. Run, 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 run! I was not anticipating how bad that was gonna go. Okay. Armor, thank you. I don't need health yet. Oh, God. I need to figure out a way to get through this quickly. I didn't even get an- Oh, no, the ammo that I wanted to get was early- Oh, okay, I left that behind by accident. Well, at least we got whatever we needed here, I guess. So that thing is not enough, really. Oh god. Oh, jeez. There we go. Kill him! Oh, I had to get his heart. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for teaching me the lessons of what I need to do to get this guy out of here. I threw the knife by accident, though. Where did I throw the knife? What the heck? I threw my my third knife. No. That knife could have come in handy by accident. For whatever reasons. Oh, is that the knife? Yeah, there it is. Damn it. Knife. Okay. Oh, jeez. He's coming closer. Okay, there we go. 
Screw you. Take him. Take your heart out. Oh, that was infuriating. But I, I at least got it down. <laughs> oh my god, that was really bad. But it was at least decently not too bad. Yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Let's see the map. Okay, now we can find the collectibles like we normally would. Fantastic. I thought we were not going to get the gold or the, the, the stuff that we normally would get it. Oh, we can climb up the way that way. Okay. Totally, totally understandable. I don't need the armor. I don't know why I kept grabbing more armor. Shotgun, I didn't... Did I? Let me reload both of these and then get the ammo. The extra ammunition. No? Oh, that kind of sucks. The amount that I can carry is not enough, really. Oh, I maxed out a knife. So if I did lose a knife, I could just reload my knife amount amounts from that chair stores. Um. Yeah. So the the pistol rocket launcher ammo that I found was when I started out in this level, but since I died, <laughs> it reset my uh, my amount that I could have carried on it. Or the amount that I could have gotten it in. That kind of sucks, though. It kind of sucks overall that that was the case with that. By far, this was a better run than the first one. The other one, the first one I did was okay. It was, like, enough to what I needed. But then, ultimately, this was the better, the better version of learning how to take down these enemies a little bit more differently. It's kind of strange that they started doing a bit more, uh, a different more... A different thing out of it like they're trying to make you try to get close up to them almost like a design that doom does doom 2016 like doom 2016 kind of has it where their enemies are like they force you to kind of like or try to push you to like get close to them rather than just kill them from afar so it's pretty interesting to see where uh where they kind of align similar like design values of uh of how you handle enemies which is nice i actually think that whoever made that idea i think at first i kind of disliked it because it was a little bit not intuitive at first but i think over time once you fight against uh like once you understand the rules then you can actually utilize it more properly but if you didn't understand the rules i think that that's where i kind of disliked it that it doesn't explain it or kind of show you like examples of like electricity is the key to problems to these guards and soldiers and such. You've unlocked a challenge. But why do I want a challenge? Is it because I cleared the, 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 the whole space? Yeah, maybe. Actually. No, did I do this to myself? Okay, no, I didn't. Okay, I thought I missed the question mark that I saw earlier in the map. <laughs> Who are you? Oh, is this guy again? Is this guy like a secret agent or something? He does have something on his hair. Oh, he has a flower, I thought. A part of me wants to just, like, get rid of this guy, but I'm, like, I'm not that, like, cold-hearted about it. <laughs> it's just that he keeps showing up, and he's just, like, being funny and random a little bit. Okay, there should be some secrets here, right? Oh, it's a nightmare. Is this what the secret thing is? It is. The nightmare is the secret thing. You know what? Let's do it. I mean, since we're here already, why not? And why not, since we're here? Thanks a lot for your pistol ammo. Thank you again. Alright. Uh, I don't think there's any secret spots here. But I'm going to try to mark up the map as much as possible as I usually do. Yeah, I need to, like, get up close to the wall to, like, 
sh reveal it on the map more properly. Which is kind of weird to me that that's the way that they do it. But it's whatever. Alright, here we go. Oh god. There's a dog out here. Somewhere. I hear dog somewhere. Yeah, one of the doors on my right is like a dog door. One of them has like a dog sitting behind there waiting to pounce at me. <laughs> okay, let me walk around furthermore. Yeah, the last time when we went through the nightmare levels, there wasn't really much secret doors, I guess. Secret like walls to open up. There was like probably one in that space, I think. But unfortunately, not much beyond that. Oh yeah, I hear the dog. Let me see the map. Yeah, it looks like it's from the same room anyways. Man, he sounds like a lion rather than a dog. Oh, jeez. Thank you. Sorry. Yeah, it sounded more like a lion than a dog. <laughs> In a weird way to me. <clears throat> because it's like, roar, roar. Okay, there's nothing there. Yeah, it's nothing to it. Alright, so that's that's that, I guess. Uh yeah, let's go what, is, is it this way? Yeah. Let's go this way. Yeah, I can't make mental notes of the map very well because Oh god. I thought there was somebody behind me for some reason, but there wasn't in a weird way. Kind of thought there would at least be an enemy behind me, but no. Oh god. At least they don't know that I'm coming at them. Okay, that sounded wrong. Uh, at least they don't know that I was shooting at them until I became more visible to them. Yeah, I don't know why I said that. <laughs> so, you know, sometimes words are just tricky to just live with. Especially English. It's just like, come on, let's do it. Well, English is my primary native language. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Am I getting in uh, insane? Am I being ridiculous? Maybe. Maybe not. Who knows? Alright. Um. No, not this way. I'm, or I'm just looking at the map a bit, just filling out whatever I haven't filled out yet. I'm gonna go through this corner at least, I guess. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god. Okay. I just like how they they have like the oh god. <laughs> I think it was the Simpson character that that did that. There was a Simpsons character that I remember seeing. Or watching that had that sort of thing. Uh, so this is a door that I should go through. Oh, jeez. Was that it? <laughs> it's only these two? I thought there would be more. I, I felt like there would be more at least. But alright. I'll take it. Um, let me see what's over here. I feel like these entrances could be a secret something, but it seems like not. Alright. Yeah, this is not a secret entrance. Uh, it's just a corridor hallway looking space that leads to a dead end room for some stuff like this. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. There we go. I needed to like literally aim for his head more often because that is the only way to literally get rid of them much more quickly with a pistol specifically I guess all right cool that's pretty much the end of this space all righty let's get out of here so that led to sort of a dead end um yeah let's go to the very top here because that's another sort of unique spacing. Almost like a prison-like space, it looks like, almost. Oh, jeez. 
Okay. Oh, it's a bed corridor kind of thing. Like a bedroom. Barracks. No. Jeez, what is it called? <laughs> Where... Is it the bunker? The bunkers? I guess? Yeah, I guess. This is like the room where all the soldiers sleep, in a sense. Yeah, I guess that's pretty much what that is. Nothing more. Right. Uh... Yeah, let's get down. Let's get down to the other side. Sorry, I'm just looking at the stuff and just thinking, like, what do I want to target next in terms of, like, searching for the rooms? Honestly, this one is a little bit interesting in my mind because like if i look at the map there's a lot of like rough edges oh i didn't see i didn't even i thought i went through this already for some reason okay at least we can try this thank you some silver indeed i still don't know what these old silvers are like they feel like they're collectibles but they're not really much beyond that like, it's collectible specifically in this particular Nightmare Fuel place. I don't know why I say Nightmare Fuel. I guess it's like the Nightmare's levels, I guess. One room probably leads to a dead end, but we'll see. Oh, jeez. It's like a shotgun in this guy. Okay, there we go. Alright. At least I didn't lose too much, considering... That's my pistol ammo that I didn't need. Actually, no, I went down to 75. Shoot. I missed the map. It keeps on going. Uh, Let's see. I'm thinking I want to head back for the dog meal. Because that's the dog meals will definitely push me back up to my health I need originally. Yeah, the dog meals from earlier. The, the kennel, the small mini kennel space. That we saw earlier with the dog stuff. Let's get to that. For some reason, these plants always seem to feel like they're actually like enemies, but they're not really enemies at all. No, this is where I started. It's over here. Right here. I just want to do that so I can just like get to 100 health again. Why don't we just go through here since it's convenient enough? Convenient enough to try to get through here, I guess. Ooh, this is a tight corridor. Tight hallway thing. Alright, cool. Took at least. Oh, jeez. I saw that guy, but I can't, like, do much. So I need a key. Got it. I wonder how does that door look like? Okay, this didn't look like anything much. I was like, at least make me, like, have some sort of, like, way to understanding how... Understanding how the the thing looks, like... Well, we're gonna have to return to it later, so we're gonna have to make our way through the spot anyways. Oh, jeez. Got to reload before then. I don't even know where the key would be at, but my hope is the key is not too far from this area, I guess. And this is some really long hallways. It takes about... Yeah, it takes about 10... No, not 10. Probably like 5-7 seconds to get across to this hallway. I'm a little concerned about the length of how long it takes to just get to this hole through these hallways. Oh, more food. Cool. Quick scan of the space there. Uh, yeah. Let me rub up against this wall a little bit so I can just get some of the the stuff kind of detected out. Right around the here. Okay. Yeah, I wanted to, to, to get a rough edge of what the room looks like from wherever this place is here. This spot has another door here, so might as well. Yeah, that's pretty much that space. Oh, jeez. Oh, God. I haven't used my machine gun yet, so... I should probably do that.
Oh, jeez. All that ammo did not hit him at all, or something. That's fascinating, that it didn't hit him all at once. <laughs> I was like, there's gotta be, like, it's gotta be, like, really, like, easy to get this guy down. But no, it didn't make it easy. Like, at least made it a little bit more easier for me to, like, get rid of the guy. Alright, I think that's pretty much that. I guess this was just the silver's room. The old silver room. So we can just, like, get whatever was, uh, was appropriately made. Okay, so this room was just pretty much just more collectible stuff that, that existed in that spot. Alright. I believe we came in through this room, I guess. Yeah, we came in through that hall. What? Why is there a dead end? Is this a random ass dead end? <laughs> Wait, is there something here? Yeah, this is a random dead end. I'm surprised. I thought it would have like... I thought it would like corner in, like lead us to this pathway right here. I thought it was going to connect into that, but apparently not. Oh, there's a secret thing. Let me... Move around here a little bit just to get other thing get other things kind of detected. Okay, there is a secret spot. So they don't show you the secret stuff on the map. Yeah, they don't show you the secret stuff on the map. But this also doesn't have wait. Wait, there's another <sighs> Why? Why is there another spot over here? That also does not really... I don't really need that though. Okay, so secret stuff don't show up on the map, but sometimes they do, I guess? I mean, the last time when I checked, they were showing up a little bit, but... I guess it's not really in the way. Okay, well, that's whatever, I guess. I don't know anymore. Uh, is this the way I went? Yeah, this is the way I came from. Um, we need to go back down to the other space. What a shame. I went all the other way, came through this way, and guess what I get? Nothing. Nothing of the key. Ugh. That's what I get for, like, walking the right way and then walking back. Doubting. Not doubting, but, like, wanting to get full health. Kind of sucks a little bit, but hey. Lesson learned. I mean, I did do very poorly in some of the... The shooting for the for the levels here, but it's what it is, I guess. All right, here we go. Yeah, let's go this room first. Oh, there's nothing in here. Nothing super important in here, though. Okay. I I take an empty room any day, actually. <laughs> no secrets either, so. Yeah, it's just a literal like nothing. Nothing burger. All right, we 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 already cleared this room out, so we're good. That is one stinking long hallway. This nightmare level specifically feels like I'm walking into a headquarters of some sort, but it's just way too long hallways. I mean, to be. To, to, to be fair, I've designed levels that have long hallways, but I often count how much I take, how much time I take to get from one end to the other. And my guess here is that this is taking about 10 seconds to get from one end to the other end of the hallway. I'm just surprised how long these hallways could be. Oh, Jesus. That scared me. <laughs> that scared me like hell. Well, at least it's an empty room. I'll take that. Like, every time I, I go through these doors, I'm I'm glad it's an empty room, rather than actually being like... Oh, jeez, another one. I'm just, like, glad it's an empty room and not so much as, like, a big, long haul again. I think it's probably because it's that feeling of, like, going through so freaking far-off, like, spaces that it's made me feel less inclined to care about a long hallway like this. 
Maybe that's the intention, I guess. Maybe the level designer was like, hey, I want to make long hallways, but then have people feel comfortable with, like, small rooms as, like, a break point almost, or, like, a comforting feel. I don't know. It feels that way a little bit. Let me actually... No, I can't get to this corner because it's way too blocked off with a barrel. Yeah. All right. One last area, which is here. There we go. I feel like there would have been more cards around. But I guess there's not a lot of guards, I guess. Oh, jeez. Oh, son of a gun. Scared me. I was not even paying attention behind me. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> oh, yeah. We're almost out of time. All right. Let's get the key, and I'll end the episode there once I get the key. I mean, honestly, the rest of the way through is very straightforward. It's just me literally walking to the literal, like, doorway, which I probably might take the episode to get there. I don't know. Oh, dogs. Hi, doggy. Hi, doggy. I'm sorry, doggy. Oh, more dogs! Is it guarded by dogs? Is this place guarded by dogs only? Oh, there's the key. Alright, yeah, it is apparently guarded by dogs in this space, I guess. I'm very... Very, very surprised that it's guarded by dogs, but yeah, okay, I guess. Alright, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode or another video of mine. So, hope you guys have a great, amazing day. We can for whenever we're watching this. I'm sorry, I'm just filling up the gaps that I can. Next episode, let's take a look at the remaining rooms, I guess, and then we'll make our way back to, with the key to open up the path and then leave this freaking long hallways McGee level, I guess. There's too many long level, long hallways, really. There's just too much long hallways. 10 second long hallways are just what the hell, dude. It just makes me feel a little bit <laughs> annoyed of how long these hallways are. <laughs> Though, I, I mean, I understand that it might be, like, for the sake to just build tension maybe but then it's hard to feel tension if nothing usually jumps out at you in a weird way so it's like i don't know feels a little bit too it feels weak i wouldn't say it's the worst but it just feels pretty weak for me to through this level so far anyways i'll go I'll, I'll go and finish this next episode so that's pretty much it for now so thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one Roz. Ah.